Now, the Equality Act has nine protected characteristics. These are things such as sex, race, disability, and religion slash belief. And when we talk about the protected characteristic of religion and belief, generally, religion doesn't cause us a tremendous amount of problems. We're not going to fall out if I say that Sikhism, Hinduism, Buddhism are religions. I'm, I'm sure of that. It is belief where it gets more complicated. Let's have a look at some cases that help us to understand what is and isn't belief. And maybe the case that is most commonly quoted is that of Granger PLC and others versus Nicholson. And this is very often seen as the fundamental case. And if you read rulings in more recent cases about belief, you typically will see the Nicholson case being referenced. So what was it all about? Well, Nicholson was head of sustainability at the property developers Grangers. He was selected for redundancy and he believed that he had been selected because he had a passionate belief about the sanctity of the environment and the concern about climate change. Now, what about the case of X versus Y? This was a COVID case where the employee had been working from home due to COVID lockdown, was told, was, as lockdowns were uh, released, that she was required to come back to work. She had a partner who was vulnerable, medically vulnerable. And she said, no, I can't come back to work because I have a fear of catching COVID. And that fear is so strong. Actually, it's a belief as defined in the Equality Act 2010. 